You're watching Newcastle Fans TV. Hello, everybody. It's just Lee back. Um, just just popped in the stadium. Um, I said I'll do a raw video today. Of in today's video, I'm just basically talking about the club's improvement on the social media side of things. So I'm just at, up at the back end of St James's Park, as you'll see behind us there. That's the players' entrance down there. So I'm just going to walk on the ground there quickly. So some of you will know that roughly about a month ago, I put out a video criticising the club on the social media and the relationship that we've got with fans and since that video's gone out um, a lot of a lot of people have been saying it's because of the video that I put out which I don't feel is necessarily true so just for anyone wondering that's the entrance to the ground for the for the cars and everything so they've improved massively since I put the video obviously I criticised Newcastle's lack of social media commitments to the fans since then you've seen a lot more the thing I like about it, you've seen a lot more improvement. There's a couple of things that they need improvement. So first of all, you've seen the improvement of the uh, Snapchat as well. So you've seen that improvement massively. They've got updates all the time on Snapchat and talking literally five, six, seven snaps per day. If you're not following Roland Aaron as well, follow him. He's really, really funny on it. Instagram, Instagram the, but enough they've released a new Instagram coming out as well. As people are shouting over there. So... New Instagram account has actually come out, a brand new one, and they've been posting frequently is the word I'd describe as a much, much better relationship that we've had, that they've had with the fans as well. Twitter has been updated as per usual, a lot but a lot more uh, activity on Twitter as well. I like the fact that the under 21s are getting a bit of uh, notice as well. I think still the under 21s still need to be shown a lot more. Um, also, you've got things like Periscope as well. Now, I don't have a Periscope, Periscope account, however, they're putting a lot of the behind the scenes footage on Periscope, which is nice for the fans to see, like live streams before the game and everything. So, I think that's a good thing. Uh, um, Facebook, as per usual, uh, they're, being, they're very, very active on Facebook, so I like the fact that they are doing that. So, the usual updates as I come into the, come into the sun. So, they've got the usual updates on Facebook. Like every four or five posts, you know. Um, you've also got the YouTube account. Now the YouTube account is suffering at the moment with YouTube, as I still feel Newcastle meetups are putting a lot more content out on YouTube because they're suffering massively at the moment. So I apologise about the noise there. So at the moment, the YouTube videos a lack of footage from even NUFC TV. It doesn't have to be a great deal. But generally speaking, that needs to improve. However, all in all, you have to say that the social media side of things has improved with Newcastle. And hopefully, the same more of a continue. Now, we know it's pre season at the moment, but you've got to think when the pre season's over and when the games start to matter, that the coverage starts to take place afterwards, and knowing the game's thick and thin, that you're still going to have all this behind the scenes footage because that's what we want as fans. So I thought I'd just bring that up, you know, and uh, I'm up towards the um, just behind the Gallagher end now, which is above us. Um, so I'm just walking around. So I thought it would just be something different for you today as well. Also, coming up on the channel as well, I've been investigating around other fans channels as well so we've got some good ideas coming up on there as well but I thought I'd just chuck this out there because it's a bit raw but let me know what you think I'm going to be blocked off because there's cars and everything yeah um, try and get around here but yeah just let, just let me know um, of any ideas yourself I've also got the fantasy football remember that's coming up as well so if you haven't been entered a pin I'll try, uh, if you haven't entered the league I'll give you the pin enter that's really good but I'm going to leave you because I'm going to head off back into work. So I've been Lee on behalf of Newcastle Fans TV. See you later.